Hi guys, um, I'm sorry that my lighting is, really? is going to be my contest entry for Nadia and um, her link will be posted on the sidebar. You guys can check it out. Ooh, look at my nails. Christmas nails. Anyhow, um, so yeah, so, you know, I kind of just did a little blending there. I still haven't even removed my tape. So we can, let's go ahead and do that so you guys can see whoa, what the look looks like. Um, and it is a blend of pinks, purples, and black with a little bit of highlight on the brow bone. And I use pink clearly because that is the theme of this contest. Wow, I look really pale. Yeah. Anyhow, I use pink um, because that's the theme of the contest. Um, I also use purple because it's another one of her favorite colors. And um, I kind of mixed in some burgundies and black. And it just, it looks, I think it looks really pretty. It's like a dark pink, um, nothing too bright. I was going to go for the bright look, but then I decided to go for something more extravagant, more, um, I don't know, something to wear at night, something to go out really nice. And what I like is that it has, if you guys can tell, this sharp um, look right here at the end. And it just makes it look so much more glamorous and so much more um, intriguing to the eye. Okay, guys, so I'm going to start to show you the look. Anyhow, I forgot to tell you that this is my inspiration um, for the Tinkled Me, Tickled Me Pink contest, and it's my scarf that I'm going to be wearing today, and it has a lot of different shades of pink, burgundies, and purples, so I thought that was um, something cute. So anyhow, let's go on with um, the tutorial entry. Okay, so I'm going to take my um, angled shadow brush, and this is from Forever Female Cosmetics. And I absolutely love the brushes. I'm going to take um, some, I'm going to do a bottom coat on my eye first. I've already applied my Urban Decay Primer um, and all that good stuff. So I'm taking this Urban Decay Palette, this shadow box. And I'm going to be taking the color Polyester Bride, which is this white color right here. It's like a beigey white color with some glitter. And I'm just going to dab my brush in there just a little bit. And kind of just um, brush over just to give me a white base. Now, you also could use a dark base um, depending on how you want the colors to show. I am already using dark colors, so I want a white base just to lighten them just a little bit. So once I have that on there, um, and I absolutely love this brush because it really gets into your tear duct. I'm just going to apply it a little bit over the crease, and voila. So you have that. Then what I want to do is to achieve this um, very straight, sharp look. I'm just going to take a small little piece of tape. You guys can see that. There you go. And I'm just going to apply it right here. Like that. So now what I'm going to take is a... Sorry about my camera, you guys. I'm taking a flat shadow brush, and I'm trying to do this as quickly as possible. And I'm going to be using um, this hot pink color from Obsessive Compulsive, and it's in Cherry Bomb. And I absolutely love it because this color is just so vibrant. Um, <clears throat> just like my personality. No, I'm kidding, you guys. I'm just in a goofy mood today. Um, so I'm going to take some of that hot pink and I'm just going to apply it the inner corner of my lid and I'm going to brush up, upward. As you guys can see. And I'm going to pack it on real good because I'm going to be blending in anyway, so... So I kind of want to get a little round effect, and if I don't, it's fine, because when you blend in, you'll, you'll be fine. So I'm kind of going to go ahead and go all the way up to the middle of my eye with the hot pink. And then I'm just going to, whoa, whoa, I don't want to do this, the purple. Set that aside. Just, um, it's good if you guys have like a little wet cloth, not wet, but a little dry cloth um, while you're doing this, so that you can just swipe off your brushes so you don't have to continue using different ones. Um, it just makes it more confusing, at least for me, anyhow. But, um, okay. So I'm going to have that like that. Then I'm going to take this color right here. And this is from, again, the Urban Decay Shadow, back, shadow Box. Shadow Box. Yeah. Last Call, and it's a burgundyish purple color. And I'm just going to take some of that and apply it from the middle all the way across. And I'm going to make sure I bring it even more into the middle because I'm going to blend. And I get that in real good. That. 
done, as you guys can see, I'm going to take Oil Slick, which is a black color, as you guys can see, from the Urban Decay palette. And I am just going to circle it in. into the crease. Okay guys, so now I'm gonna take some liquid liner and this is from Jordana. I'm just trying to hurry up because I wanna keep this under 10 minutes. Um, and I'm just gonna brush along um, the line. I'm just gonna take some on my powder brush this is from foreverfemale.com. And just apply it. Then I'm going to take um, some bronzing powder. You guys know if you watch my videos, you see which one this is. I absolutely love it. Love it, love it. Um, and it says bronzing powder, but again, I explain every time. It's more like highlight. Uh, the lighting is so bad, you guys. I'm sorry. Let's see. Probably can't appreciate it. Um, and this is from Neve Cosmetics, and it's a nice pink color. And I'm just going to take some of it and just brush it across my lips. I just like to mix a whole mess of lipsticks together, you guys. You should know that by now. Hi, guys. So I'm back, and I'm back with my final look. I will be posting pictures um, on the sidebar. I mean, not on the sidebar, in this video, simply because I don't think that you guys are actually going to get the gist of all the pink because of my bad lighting, which sucks. So I'm sorry about that. Um, but this is my completed look. And it's just basically what I guess I would call it is um, my smoky, tickle me pink. Um, and for the lip gloss, I, I've uh, used this color and it's an LG06. And this is from Apartment 5, lip sh the lip shine. Um, and this is, from my understanding, only sold in New York in Duane Reed Pharmacies. Um, so I used that. I also, before applying this, I used from Lip Balm with Attitude. I used their Deep Throat Lip Coat. Yes, parental advisory for these lip balms. These are amazing. I will be doing a um, uh, review and tutorial on these. Not tutorial, more review um, and haul. So this one is in Vanilla Mint Super Sensation and it's delicious. Um, and then I mixed in this all made color in Lift. Is it Lift? Yeah. And it's like a nice wind color. And I mixed it in because I thought it went blended perfectly to a nice pretty pink. Um, but it is a wine color. I got this at Dollar Tree. So anyhow, that is um, my, my contest entry for Nadia's contest. Tickles me pink. As you can see, it matches my scarf. That was the purpose. Um, and my little bow. So... I'm going to put my hair down and I will be ready to um, go out and kind of just go shopping now. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, thank you, Nadia, for such an amazing contest. I absolutely love it. I think it's great. Um, I love pink. It's my favorite color. I do like purple also. It's my second favorite. Um, so thank you so much for having this contest. I can't wait to enter for my second entry and I hope you enjoy and love my entry. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and rate. Bye guys.